Hello YouTube. Today I'm going to show you how to scrap this electric coffee pot by Kenwood. So yeah, fortunately there's no pesky uh, tamper proof bits. Looks like all these can be removed. I've already removed one of the little um, bumpers, little feet that keep this from getting scratches at the bottom. And as you can tell, it's just an ordinary Phillips head screw. So, you can pop all these off very easily. Little rubber feet. And, you just go at it with your screwdriver. There's our three screws. Just cleaning it up a bit. Alright, and the bottom plate should come right out. This is a very, very simple piece of equipment. Nothing much going on. So, now we remove. I am removing two screws that hold the power cord in place. Alright. And we can pull this right out. Well, we can, but One end, and pull out the other end, and this bottom part here is plastic. The top part here has a nitty bitty little silver contact. It's hard to see that, but there we go. Real simple. You can just pull that off. Put that to the side with our silver contacts. And you can just snip off these wiring here. Yeah, in fact, like the previous video with the um, little steamer for the clothes. This one is not too much like a um, coffee maker. And it's also not too much like a, um, what was it called? A iron, because they both have a heat conducting material, a little thermostat switch right there to regulate the temperature, and a big piece of metal that conducts heat. Let's see, now let's do. Oh, I see. So on the sides, there, you can see a little screw. And just pull that right out. I will not be stopped. Big guns. Hmm. Oh, and that doesn't work. There we go. Just pulled it right out. And this piece is steel. And 
once again. Another thermostat. More silver. And trash. That's weird. Anyway, somehow pull off this piece. It appears to be some stainless steel. And there we go. So, yeah, I hope you found that video interesting and useful. Please like the video if you enjoyed it. Comment, tell me something, what you think I could do better, and what I think I should subscribe next. And subscribe for more future content on the Scrap Band. And until next time, thanks for watching.